The historic payment was made by the Japanese Nishimatsu Construction Company to five surviving Chinese former forced laborers. The events that led up to this week's historic event go back over six decades. In 1944, around 360 Chinese citizens were sent to Hiroshima in Japan by the Nishimatsu Construction Company. There, they were forced to work in appalling conditions. 29 laborers died either in Japan or on the ship that repatriated them after Japan's defeat in 1945. In 1998, the five plaintiffs took Nishimatsu to court, demanding an apology for their treatment and asking for compensation. In July 2004, the Hiroshima High Court awarded damages to the five plaintiffs. The ruling marked the first time a Japanese court had ruled in favor of Chinese wartime laborers in such a case. Finally, in October, an agreement was reached that the company would pay $2.74 million to the Chinese laborers or their relatives. Each victim or victim's family will receive $6,660 in compensation. The rest of the money will go towards building a memorial in Hiroshima and to search for other missing victims or their surviving families. Mark Dreyer, BON.